Hey friends, today we're going to talk about different ways to represent numbers. Here we have four different ways that we can represent a number. We have standard form, expanded form, base 10 form, and word form. The number that we're going to be representing today is 246. Standard form means just to write it the regular way. So you're used to seeing numbers written this way, 246. We have our ones place, our tens place, and our hundreds place. This is standard form. Next, we're going to move on to expanded form. Now, in expanded form, we want to stretch out the number by the place values. So starting with the hundreds place, we have a 2 in the hundreds place. And 2 in the hundreds place gives us a value of? 200. In our tens place, we have a four, and we know that four tens is a value of 40. And lastly, we have the ones place to add on. There's a six in our ones place, which is a value of six. So we have 200 plus 40 plus six is the same as 246. It's the same number, just represented two different ways. Next, we're going to do base 10 form. In base 10 form, we're just going to draw base 10 blocks to represent the number. So again, starting with the hundreds place, we have 200. So I'm going to draw out two hundreds here. One, two. We have four tens. One, two, three. Four and six ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two hundreds, four tens, and six ones. Two hundred forty six. Now, for word form, it's just like it sounds. You're just going to write out this number using words. So we're going to spell out two hundred forty. Six. And this is the word form for this number. So here you see four different ways to represent 246. All four of these have a, the same value. They are the same number, just shown different ways.